MLB The Show team have been hard at work innovating on the core components of the features of the in-game experience. An entirely new commentary system and broadcast team featuring John Boog Skiambi and Chris Singleton for the first time in the show history. They're replacing play-by-play -play man Matt Vaskersian, who has been with the series since its inception in 2006, and MLB Network analyst Dan Plesak and Mark DeRosa, who had been in the game since 2017 and 2018 respectively. While we all love Matty V, the community has been asking for a fresh new take at commentary, so this is a much welcome change. Along with the addition of Boog and Singy, there are five profound ways commentary is completely changing and will be the show 22. So we're gonna walk through that in this video as well as a little bonus for those that stick around to the end. But before we jump in, please consider subscribing as I'll be covering all the news on the road to launch on April 5th. All right, let's get into it. Number one, there were 128 separate recording sessions that occurred, which included 350 recording hours and approximately 45,000 lines of audio. Here's a little sneak peek of their commentary in MLB The Show 22. Swing and a deep drive and forget it. Zingy, he's been red hot. Man, he is really seeing the ball well in this one. In time, got him. And yet another twin killing. Pretty dominant double play. Number two, the commentary systems have been redesigned for several major categories, including game intros, home run calls, post play analysis, and much more. Number three, there's a new conversation system that has been implemented, allowing for a more natural banter between commentators that seamlessly integrates into the live action of each game. Boog and Singy recorded a lot of their lines together to bring this feature to life. Number four, audio stitching enhancements increase the variety of both play by play calls and color commentary. To to improve upon player name integration. There's an enhancement in the dynamic range of play-by-play -play calls has also been implemented to match the excitement of every moment. At number five, content captured for both real life and MLB broadcasts and MLB The Show commentary leads to a curated experience that's unique for each player. So you're gonna hear actual calls they made from MLB broadcasts in addition to those 45,000 lines that are recorded specifically for the show. This in many ways almost doubles the lines of audio that are out there. So a little bit about Boog and Singy. Singy played six seasons in the major leagues from 99 to 2005. He hit 300, 17 home runs, 74 ribbies in his debut season for the White Sox. He hit for the cycle in that same year, but retired from baseball and joined the White Sox radio booth as an analyst in 2006 and 2007. Singy has worked with Boog on ESPN radio since 2011 and last year was hired by the Milwaukee Brewers as a part-time analyst for Bally Sports Wisconsin. Now on the other side, Boog, he was named play by play play announcer for the Cubs broadcast on Marquee Sports Network in 2021. He held roles for the Florida Marlins, Atlanta Braves on both radio and TV. He also calls regular postseason MLB games on ESPN Radio. Boog started calling sports events for Boston College when he was undergraduate in the 90s and both have done quite a bit for the game. It's exciting to get a new commentary team but I'd love to hear your thoughts down in the comments below. So now if you've missed some of the feature reveals click this playlist here as I've got everything in just one playlist ready to go for you. All right. Until the next one, we'll see ya. Peace.